So we completed a vertical lookup. Let's now look at horizontal lookup. So in this example, the table of data is presented to us horizontally in a horizontal array versus the grades was in a vertical array. So we're going to need a different formula. And that formula is simply H lookup. So I'm going to come up here and make sure I get that functions dialog box. Here's the H lookup. Here's my dialog box. I'll position it over here. Now there is something unique about this one in that what we're trying to find is a textual value that represents the month, not a numerical value. So what this means is that we're actually going to have to find an exact match. And you'll see what I mean here in a minute. So the lookup value I'm looking for is January. And the table array, I'm going to go ahead and just select the exact table without its header and choose F4 to absolute that so that the position stays uh, absoluted. Consequently, here the row index that I'm looking to return, it's not a column but a row. It's going to look up the data in row one. It's going to return row two. Now, if you notice here, it says it's looking up January. We got that, but it's returning 0.18. Well, it should return 0.12. The reason it's returning 0.18 is it's looking right now for a close match. Now, we don't need to get into the technical um, issues here, but, but basically that, that textual data, January, February, March, is given in a binary string. And as soon as it finds a close match for that string, it goes ahead and says, that must be what you're looking for. But in this case, we want to find the exact match. So if you notice, our range lookup is a logical value. To find the closest match in the top row, sorted in ascending order, which it is, uh, it equals true. Or if we don't put anything, we're essentially looking for a close match. However, we want to find an exact match. So we're going to go ahead and type in false. And if you notice now, it's looking at January. It's returning 0.12. That's the value that we expected it to return. We'll choose OK. We'll come over here and simply fill down the values based on the months. There they are right there, based on the months. And now the last thing we want to do is make sure we audit. So I'm going to come down to the last one. Here's the value. It's looking up B12, which is what I would expect in our horizontal table and returning the exact value. So March is 0.16. We have completed horizontal lookup successfully. Now remember, we're doing this with just a small subset of data, but we could easily do this and fill down for thousands of records at a time. So take care.